I'm sure every single one of us has walked in a park or maybe walked in a wood or a forest and you'll see that some young person, perhaps a young couple, have carved their initials on a tree. And it's a very strange phenomenon because if you look, sometimes it's a, it's a young tree and you see the initials there, but sometimes you see in a much older tree and that heart with two sets of initials in them has grown and has stretched as the tree has grown. It's funny that wounds, particularly psychological wounds that we suffer when we are young, as we grow older, they grow with us. They may have faded a little bit. They may look a bit stretched, but they are still there. Over the last 2,000 years, the Jewish people have suffered wounds like that many, many times. Whether it was the first European country to expel the Jews, not Spain, that was England not Scotland. Scotland didn't let the Jews in in the first place. Or Portugal or France or whether it was the Spanish Inquisition or whether it was the Crusades, the pogroms and of course the Holocaust. Then the world has been simply describing us as being the people who are the worst in the world. The people who have done all sorts of terrible things. But really it's quite the opposite. Sometimes a window has got so much dirt on it, which is built up over weeks, months, sometimes years, it's almost impossible to see out or the other way in because it's so dirty. You have to scrub very hard to clean the glass and then be able to see what's on the other side. This process is happening again today in very, very serious quantities. The amount of dirt that is being thrown at the Jewish windows might obscure a person's ability to look and see what the Jewish people truly are and how much we should and can be proud of what we are and what we've contributed to the world. Sometimes you have to clean very hard to be able to see through. That's a challenge which is very much active today. For the world to turn around and reactivate the accusations, the false, the blood libels of the last 2,000 years behooves us as Jews to see through the lies, to clean away all that dirt, to see exactly and truly who we are, a people who are justified to be proud of our history and our peoplehood.